Can the camera get in real close on this picture? Just hold it up there and uh, get get in real close on this. Please do. Uh, picture right okay. here. Uh, all right. um, some of you may have seen my costume when I started and wondered, is that really Dracula? Well, the answer is yes, that's the way he really was. The trouble was that um, uh, on when, the, when the vampire image was created by Stoker, ultimately it came to the well-known uh, play and movie dramatizations. But what happened was the earliest dramatists overlooked some passages that Bram Stoker made in his novel to the real uh, Prince Warlord so that people watching the plays and movies mistakenly inferred that Dracula was purely fictional. And so he, he started out rather horrific but became tamer and tamer. He wasn't that horrific anymore. Oh, Until finally his real story had to be brought to light again. Okay. Well Frankie, this little house over there, you know, this is mine. This house is mine. Frankie, go oh, take a look. The light in the window, there's a window. Do you see light? This is a, my window. It's a window of my bedroom. Oh, yeah. Oh, take a look, Frankie. lady. You know, who is it? Like? Oh, this is my wife. Yeah, this is my wife. Oh. Take a look, take a look. Such a young, such a beautiful and charming person. This guy, oh, he's nice and good looking. He's kissing her and he's hugging her. Oh, you know, who is it, Frank? This is, this is me. Good morning, Long Island. We're gonna make it a wonderful day. Good morning, my Long Island. Oh, wow. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, uh, you want me to sing another song? Well, we don't have too much time. Oh, okay. If you, no, if you want to go. You, yeah, sure. You One can. song's enough. No, okay. <laughs> no, so you go ahead, Stryker. It's right. okay. I said it's okay. This is romantic, so I'm going to take my glasses off. Okay. Lights out, baby. Shut up. We had a busy day. Shut up. Okay. Nighty night, then. Shut up. Maybe. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. All right, David, that's not very nice enough. Why don't you have a seat then? Uh, so I can, maybe you can come back and sing that one next. Uh, 
Okay, David, now you embarrassed uh, me in front of uh, all our nice guests and... Uh... Where the countdown races come to town, hey, a do-da, mm, a do-da, and hey, a countdown ladies are five miles around, oh, a do-da day. And I am definitely topsy turvy, sirs, but not the topsy child cat, and not little Eva or Uncle Tom's cabin, unless hey, a big box ring tingling is got. It's a jet liner or hmm, a slow boat up to China, guys. Come on, guys, let your fingers do the walking. Uh, or down up the yellow pages. Have home, we'll travel on uh, your pad or mine. Come on up and hey, uh, see me uh, sometime. That was wonderful. That was wonderful. 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 <laughs> well, that's something you don't see every day. And that's what makes Gretchen so special. Gretchen is a very special performer, and we're very happy to have you because beyond vaudeville, that's what we're all about, having people that you don't see every day and people that deserve more exposure. And um, now, maybe you could talk about what, uh, what that was, that act that you did. What, oh, what, it, what I do are critiques upon our present-day civilization in a semi-risque comedic way. So. A lot of it is from my point of view, other ladies, on Julie ladies, you know, modern day on Julie ladies, you know, we are the clowns, let us entertain you, and so on. And I'm kind of serious, but not really, and it's a spoof and a satire. I also want to show you, uh, uh, I am taking up uh, ventriloquism now. And, uh, I have uh, my Charlie McCarthy doll. And I want to show you how he talks. Uh, how are you today, uh, uh, Charlie? Oh. oh. Okay. All right, uh, David. Well, if you're going to be tough, uh, I put my Desert Shield uh, gun. Ah. <laughs> All right. Okay. I want to be a movie star. Mr. Furman, uh, yeah. okay, you, uh, okay. Now you're, uh, you hold a number of uh, rec world records, right, in the Guinness yeah. uh, book. Could, could you please get out of the way? Okay, uh, now <laughs> you have ten, uh, ten world yeah. records in, in the uh, book. That's right, yeah. Now, does, is one of those records the number of records you have? Or? Uh, yeah, it's the record for the most records. Okay. The utility record. Now, uh, uh, what do those records include? You've uh, done pogo sticking uh, underwater, right? Pogo sticking underwater in the Amazon River. Oh. Three hours and 40 minutes. Uh, most distance. Okay. Pogo sticking 15 miles. Um, running a marathon, juggling three balls. Oh. Three hours and 22 minutes. Wow. Um, and most you... deep knee bends in an hour. And most you uh, squat thrusts in an hour. Please don't interrupt while I'm doing Most uh, <laughs> squat thrusts in an hour. Right. Uh, bouncing a milk bottle on my head. Uh, for 43 miles. I couldn't even do that. Wow. Right. And uh, yeah. a bunch of other things. Uh, hop, most games of hopscotch in 24 hours. Okay. 307 games completed. And you uh, and you yodel too, right? That's right. 27 hours of yodeling. Can you yodel while you pull those? Sure. Song. Glory, hallelujah, I just told the parson, take part, get ready to call. Just like Humpty Dumpty, I'm gonna fall. So I sit and sit and I top of the world. I'm rolling along. 
just floating along. On one in a million, I'll get my share. I only got one suit, just one. That's all I can wear. A bottle of money. Oh, make me good day. As with a honey. Song. Lord, hallelujah, I just post the parson. Hey, Paul, I get ready to call. Just like Humpty Dumpty, I'm gonna fall. So I'm sitting, sitting on top, top of the world. I'm running along. So I'm known as the Edith Bunker of massage, and this is what I do. First I put the oil on, then I rub it in the skin, <laughs> mush the muscle till it's smooth. Stay for the night, or maybe a bite. I could show you my favorite obsession. I've been making a man with blonde hair and a tan, and he's good for relieving my tension. I'm just a sweet transvestite <laughs> from transsexual Transylvania. the lab and see what's on the slab I see you shiver with anticipation but maybe the rain is uh, really to blame so I'll remove the cause <laughs> But not the symptom. Maybe you could show uh, show everyone a little bit of how you how you do the whistling through your your nose. Okay, uh, so it's just a uh, take one deep breath and bring the air up. Once the air hits my my Adam's apple, I uh, let the air come out through my nose with a song, and this is how it's done.
climbing Harpo's ladder. Say it with me. Same verse. It repeats. We are, are come on, climbing Harpo's ladder. Just an opera hat full of yellow chickens. Hit it, puppets. Just, Just an, an opera, opera hat full of yellow chickens. Chicken. He was a soldier of the clowns. He, he was, was a soldier, soldier of, of the, the clowns. Clown. Sing it at home, too. Now, now, uh, now. soldier, do you love my cream pies? Everybody reach out at this time and grab an invisible cream pie and, and hold it in your hand. Decide. It weighs about two or three pounds. Need a hand. De decide if it's chocolate. Okay. Yeah, that hand's good. Uh, uh, coconut, uh, lemon meringue. Sir? You want to grab your pie now? Pumpkin. Okay. Well, Pumpkin. Uh, he's, he's, he's grabbing a pie in his head. <laughs> you folks out there in the audience could also grab a pie now, please. Hello. Oh. Sucredi, come on, get your pie. Decide <laughs> if it... And, and take that... You can commit pie aside, or you can squish it in your friend's face and lick each other off wait, uh, and sing right wait. now. Yeah! Oh, oh. Soldier, do you love my cream pie? Sacred so implements. Sacred implements, Sacred implements of the clowns. Harpo's Ladder, we are climbing. Here we go. We are climbing Harpo's Ladder. We are climbing Harpo's Ladder. Just an opera hat full of yellow chickens. He was a soldier of the clowns. Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Now that noise there, that's the funny mantra. I'd like everybody to do the funny mantra one time. Use your whole face. Too. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Like this, try. <laughs> Let me hear you out there in the audience too. Let's all, and all you puppets, come on. <laughs> now, now, my guru, now stop for a second. My guru, my guru Harpo Mark says, if all else fails, if you're on a bummer. Yeah. You ever get in a bummer, a bummer in New York? Right? Yeah, stand on your head. Try that, you stand on your head and no matter how big your bummer, gravity will get you smiling. Or if you're on a bummer, you could get some snakes, you could get a cuckoo clock. It's hard to stay serious with a bird hooting at you every 15 minutes, except uh, I had a water pistol. I used to squirt it at until finally it rusted in place. Well, Wavy Gravy says, if all else fails and you're on a terrible bummer, what you do is you take, you take a paper bag. Paper bag? And Right, like you gave us. Uh, yeah, like this. This right. is with handles. This is a good one. It just fits over your head. And uh, you might want to help him with his bag. Yeah, oh, I, I don't think, think you want to do that, Barry. Don't. Maybe not. No, no don't. maybe don't not. Do Free choice. No, really? Free choice. Well, do you want to... You wanna, uh, no, wait. He doesn't oh. like to play with this. Okay. Play games. Well, if you take a paper bag... You guys wait, and I'll show you here now. Okay. You take a paper bag that just fits over your head. And, and you get your... You get the, your mouth right up against the paper really gently, and you do the funny mantra. <laughs> you, turn in, you turn into a living kazoo. So let's all put our bags on now. Uh, okay. And when I say three, we'll all do the funny mantra and turn into a living kazoo, okay? Uh, okay. And you folks at home, you can go get your bags also and put them over your heads when I say three. Here we go. Bags over the heads now. Here we go. And one, two, two. three. Okay. Go for it. <laughs> Let it vibrate. One, two, three, again. And last time, one, two, three. And whip off your bags and sing with me. Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Harmony now. Kind of, kind of raise up in your chair when you make that noise. Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Sacred cushion. Sacred cushion. Sacred cushion. Of the clouds. Harpo's ladder. Last time, kids, with gusto. We are climbing. Come on. We are climbing Harpo's ladder. We are climbing Harpo's ladder. Just an opera hat full of yellow chickens. He was a soldier of the clouds. Oh. A salute to the U.S. Post Office. I'm so happy, I'm so gay. Oh, I can come twice a day. I'm your mailman. I lift your knocker, ring your bell, and you think that I am swell. I'm your a mailman, 
Oh, I can come in any kind of weather Just because my bag is made of leather Now I'd like to say, I uh, said, uh, good evening everybody, this is Ada Love, M-O-P-O, -O, MOP Radio, and uh, I want to say hello to everybody, and whoever calls me, I'll be glad to hear from you. Okay, we have now number seven is going to go on. This is Rosie from the Bronx, Rose. Oh, hello Ada Love, I'm so happy to talk to you. What should I do? I have a problem. My husband, he just wants to eat his pancakes in the morning breakfast and sit all day and watch TV. I can't do a thing with it. I'm very vivacious. I play ping pong. I go swimming. I go dancing without my husband. Uh, pardon me. Pardon me, dear. How old is your husband? Oh, my husband is 85 and I'll be 90. What should I do? Well, the only thing I can tell you is God bless you both. Thank you. Um, okay, now, uh, Ada, that was very good. Now, that was like a radio show. A that radio you made show, up. and I've been listening to radio. Burt Reynolds' sexy secret past. And that's the, is that the letter he sent you right there? Yes, love letters to Hampton, Virginia from 1970 to 73, and um, 1972, his lawyer called me, said, Miss Chantuna, you got these love letters, but now he's a superstar. Could you please send us the letters back? He the, will give you 10,000. I said, no, I'm not a movie star. I'm a just Turkish lady. I will not sell them for one million, and I never sold them. Now, you never actually met him, but you... No. But, uh, he, you, he sent you love letters. He, I was his fantasy woman. Oh. And he made the movie Deli Deliverance right. while he was in love with me. Okay. And after 1973, I lost him to Dinosaur. Yeah, but uh, do you think that uh, Dinosaur is, uh, she's not as pretty as you? you uh, I don't know. I started when I was seven years old. Oh. In Trinidad. Okay. And... Uh, doing and then, yeah. dancing and dancing and painting. Mm -hmm. Are you nervous? I uh, just uh, well, it's, uh, having such big uh, stars on it really uh, uh, sets me off a little well, bit. Well, just relax. Uh, okay. Um, what do you do to, to relax, uh, Mr. Holder? You, you just do? breathe. Okay. That's okay. right. You just do that. that yeah. Over. No, no, no. Just do it. Take a deep breath and exhale. <sighs> Much okay. better. Yeah. Okay. Now, well, that, that is much better, Mr. Much Holder. Better. Thank you. Because uh, yeah. sometimes uh, my co-host David gets me upset, and sometimes I get worked up with all the big stars, and, and now I'll know. Yeah, I just we have to uh, we're, we're, we're breathe. We are people. Breathe. Uh, Barry, um, in, the, uh, in one of the last seasons, you had uh, Robbie Rist, and we found out he's, look what he's doing. Yeah. We found him. He's doing a, a band. Uh, You're the first person I've met who cares. Is, oh, dear. Well, I thought he was good. No? no. Uh, uh, okay. Well, let's just say that as soon as he got on the show, it was canceled. Oh. Uh, I, I remember the last, it wasn't the last show with uh, Ken Berry and they, they had the three ki kids, they, they brought in yeah, new they kids. Gonna, they were going to make like another Brady Bunch out of the Brady Bunch. <laughs> right. <laughs> and, and then, meanwhile, the, but except the, they were going to use all ethnic kids. Oh, but the Brady Bunch kept going on though. You did a, a special, uh, you did a, a show with uh, Mar Sid and Marty Croft. Yeah, uh, we did the, uh, it was a Brady Bunch variety special. And, and that, in that one, the, the dad, uh, your dad uh, changed he wasn't an architect, he became a, a TV guy or something. Did was, he? Was that in, uh, oh, what show? The, uh, the Brady Bunch Hour? The Brady Bunch Hour? The Brady Bunch, Brady Bunch Hour. Variety Hour. And then the cartoon. We had the Brady Bunch cartoon show. And then we had comic books. Mm -hmm. We did the Brady Brides. Mm -hmm. It's been a fairly substantial part of my career. And, and, there's, <laughs> and let's uh, play a little from the theme song of uh, The Flying Nun. And Mrs. Spoons, you'll play the spoons for us? Fan check. 